Hi, this is Dana, and on this channel I speak about spiritual warfare. I have another channel on which I speak about astrology and the Facebook page which you will find in the description box below. Um, the usual caveat, there are individuals who are impersonating me, uh, please avoid them. Uh, they are double gangers and uh, copycats doing illegal activity and they are under investigation. Um, now, for this video, God has guided me to talk about uh, something which uh, is part of my very current research. Um, na namely, <clears throat> the, there is a project called Neuralinks uh, by Elon Musk, uh, basically, which literally says it's, it was supposed to be launched uh, in... Um, Romania, um, at the same, um, on, on Halloween day, this was announced publicly, so it was expected that there would be a public event uh, <clears throat> in um, the mountains, basically at Dracula's castle, if you can read the symbolism in this. Uh, and this project Neuralinks, uh, is basically like a sewing machine on human brain uh, it, and literally impregnates in your brain. Just research it and you will see. It, it says it impregnates in your brain certain actions which you are not able of conducting. Uh, the argument they presented is that um, <clears throat> they want to use this uh, project for uh, ill people, um, especially for example for individuals who cannot um, uh, walk and this sewing machine is supposed to in, uh, to create in your brain in human brain um, those reflexes um, which are lacking which don't exist uh, and they argue that they want to for example to make uh, an individual who cannot walk to make him walk um, and many other examples. Um, I did not. Uh, rem I, I did not uh, take notes with all details for this video because I want you to research it yourself, so you'll see it for yourself. There's public information. This is not something hidden. Um, to me, there are two symbolism extremely important. One of them is um, <clears throat> the coincidence of. Uh, launching this project on Halloween and the other one is that uh, the ceremony of launching it it's at Dracula Castle yeah now people that actually uh, are active in um, spirituality know that Dracula is a, 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 basically a, a personage which uh, a Romanian used to be a Romanian leader but which carries on a lot of significance uh, and this uh, uh, symbolically uh, connected to v um, vampires, yeah. Um, I'm not getting into details on that, yeah. I, I basically received guidance to share this information publicly uh, and to point out that this is one D March, one D March, um, of, to which I made reference of uh, uh, in earlier messages in which I explained that now that uh, the symbolism of uh, Halloween has been exposed, namely that it was a ceremony, a very wide ceremony of ritualic practices of uh, uh, religious spirituality and work with darkness in order to trap uh, identities from um, <clears throat> God's lineage. Uh, and this was um, created in order to create, this was how the 3D was created, using those identities from uh, God's lineage, which were trapped uh, into these uh, ceremonies, through these ceremonies of sacrifice and so on. Um, and the fact that they decided to launch a project like this on Halloween night, uh, I believe this speaks volumes. I personally re received uh, divine guidance that indeed this is one of the um, <clears throat> decisions they made uh, because uh, the bondage was breaking and the 3D was uh, crumbling down. As I said, this is a process. 
um, I have been investigating this for a long time. And of course, I uh, the information that I reached uh, uh, and God guided me I, to share, I shared. <clears throat> I'm sorry, there's a lot of attack on my throat chakra. <clears> throat> uh, but um, I, sh I basically invite everyone, particularly those who signed up uh, to work uh, on spiritual path with God, uh, on new assignments, and everyone else otherwise, also authorities and so on, uh, and to investigate uh, this coincidence, so-called. Um, now, as I read in an article, uh, <clears throat> they announced in the last moment that they will not have the ceremony uh, on Halloween and that they will have it one month later. Now, to me, divine guidance showed that uh, on Halloween, there was a ceremony which took part, uh, took place there, but it wasn't the public event which they planned for, particularly because um, they were already exposed and it was too dangerous. Um, and um, probably, I don't even know when, uh, it doesn't seem that uh, it was announced if the ceremony, uh, public ceremony will take place in Romania or somewhere else. Uh, but they announced that it will be towards the end of November, something like this. Uh, also, uh, interesting to note that um, this is uh, less than one month before the karmic, uh, karmic board meeting, um, as uh, deadlines in, um, uh, in spirituality, these are important deadlines. Um, okay, now uh, basically, that's why I said this is a very short message, because uh, Punctually, um, uh, God actually asked me to convey strictly this message. I was researching for myself, actually, uh, to understand the broader context. Uh, what you must understand, I made videos about <clears throat> the bondage creation and the role it played in Yalta agreement about uh, the creation of the Cold War of the two camps, East and West, right? And I explained there that the division was basically, a, and the agreement among them was basically, um, uh, how, how to put it, uh, based on um, bondage creation and contracts sold on us. And these were founded uh, through the uh, generational curses and sacrifice rituals done on us, on everybody. Even older generations who already passed away by now, but also all of us that actually were born during um, the Cold War era, yeah? Um, so uh, you, what you must understand is that now, as we expose uh, the uh, bondage creation in order to create the 3D, all of these uh, agreements and all of uh, this bondage creation and uh, the 3D creation uh, the division of power between uh, uh, countries and, and so on, which all rest on bondage creation, are all under negotiation among them. Why? Because karma, as we expose this and we break these bondages, karma is being delivered by them. Please remember what I said. Karma is being delivered by the universe. There are a number of issues which must come into play uh, for karma to be delivered. But karma is delivered anyhow. Nobody can stop it. It's a, a, a process of balancing energies in universe. Uh, this is why God is giving so many chances for repentance and redemption. Because karma is coming anyway. If you don't want to redeem, you're going to face karma. Even if God wants to, um, to help you, he won't be able to help you endlessly. There is a certain point where God will not be able to help you anymore, simply because the type of um, uh, of uh, darkness that you uh, you create is just too much, and you unleash forces which God is not willing to allow to be on earth. So it's just like this. Um, so they know karma is coming. So God has shown to me for some time now. It's not just in recent past that. Um, there's a huge commotion, uh, a lot of fights and anger among these people because they are, of course, trying to scapegoat each other, 
trying to transfer karma, trying to sacrifice other people or create new sacrifices on the same people um, in order to uh, get away, basically. Um, and in all of this madness, uh, in this video, I'm called to um, point out uh, this project, uh, which... Uh, uh, is was supposed to uh, again neural neural links is called and uh, was supposed to be launched on uh, in a public event and I would ask you to please Google the project so you'll understand about the project but please Google as well the list of invitees who was supposed to be there and this will be very interesting for you to read who which were the names. Um, which were invite the individuals who were supposed to attend. These are individuals who invented Google, individuals who invented a lot of global projects, and they normally have nothing to do with Romania. Just so you'll know. And all of them would, would have come specifically to go straight to Dracula's castle, basically, in the mountains, yeah? Um, okay. Um, I'm gonna, uh, I will probably just mention two more things, actually, <laughs> since I'm on the topic and uh, uh, the fact that uh, the division between East and West during the, for the Cold War era, the bondage creation and so on, was a proposal which came from Churchill, who was UK, uh, representing UK at the time, right? Um, I would also point out that um, Charles, King Charles now, uh, bought property in Romania in exactly similar uh, uh, region with the uh, Dracula castle. And he has stated publicly that he is connected um, and he's, he comes from the ancestral line of Dracula Vlad Cepes. Yeah. So I think also this carries uh, a lot of symbolism. I knew this for a long time now. Um, but the fact that um, while he was a prince uh, in the royal uh, UK royal house, uh, Charles bought property in Romania. And keep in mind, he would come and stay in that property for long periods of time alone uh, without any of the um, royal protocol without any, uh, just with normal security, of course, uh, and so on, but uh, very private, very private. This is, uh, to me, at least very awkward, though. Even during his marriage uh, and so on, uh, he kept coming there. Um, so I think this, this, all these are, um, uh, to me, I know the uh, research behind it, which I made, and I know that they are connected, and this is why I mentioned them. Yeah, uh, but uh, all of them are issues which carry a lot of symbolism um, uh, pertaining all of this bondage creation, 3D creation, and the spiritual fighting which we are called to carry on. Yeah, um, so uh, personally, I have called and uh, will keep calling, uh, claiming justice, judgment, and punishment on all of these individuals. That's a fact, just in case they wonder um but otherwise i'm i'm uh, sharing the information because i believe at this point in time enough of these uh, issues uh, came um <clears throat> into being uh, to be exposed publicly i have been researching for a long time uh, individual issues uh, from all of these topics uh, but at this point in time enough of them came together and I advanced enough in my spiritual fighting and bondage breaking so I can actually uh, share this publicly at this point in time, yeah? Okay.